Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another one of my adventures. Uh, today I'm making another scrap run. Still haven't got the back window fixed. Uh, going to a Sims scrapyard. Uh, that's the other scrapyard I go to when stuff's the light iron is not that good and uh, I know my other scrapyard wouldn't take most of it and it would create a hassle for me. But we're going to stop at my buddy's house, see if he has any more garage doors for me or garage door openers, stuff like that. And then I got to drop off an uh, air conditioner to Naz. So that's what we're doing today. And I was shopping around yesterday, uh, calling a bunch of different people, and found glass replacement uh, people uh, for my back window, and it's going to cost me 310 and they'll come out to the house. Uh, the safe light I called, uh, they wanted 356 and I had to go to their office, but it is what it is. I don't have many accidents like this often, so I guess a guy hit me once in a while. Alright, well, we'll see everybody at our first stop, and we'll keep you going from there. Alright, bye. Alright, so we just made it to my buddy's workshop. We got, uh, that's wood, wood, wood. Oh, they're all wood. Sorry, dude. Can't take any of that. But we got some garage door opener, so that's good. And we got a few more springs. So maybe I could drop all them off as heavy metal and got a little bit of metal in there. Alright, so guess we'll load all this up. Uh gotta separate that somehow. Otherwise, I gotta bring the garage doors home. But I'll put you guys on a time lapse. That way, I can load all this up real quick. All right, so got all that loaded on. Now we're going to head to Naz's house, drop off the air, air conditioner. Uh, but I have the front of the air conditioner in the truck because I was afraid it was on blow off. So we'll see you guys at Naz's house and then uh, I head to the scrapyard. All right, bye. I was like, oh, well, I guess we're not friends anymore. <laughs> Wait, what? Now I am rolling. Like, just because I'm rolling, you're just going to say that kind of shit? No, no, no. I was just about to say, like, well, I need some more air in the truck, so what do you think about the back window? Well, I mean, I have to, first of all, apologize because I got angry and I had to take it out on something. Ah. So I just whipped my head back and forth and... Don't play Master of Puppets in your truck with Nas in it. What, what? Brap! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I ended up sitting with Naz and talking with Naz for at least an hour and a half to two hours. Just going over things about uh, YouTube and everything, uh, different things I didn't know, and he was trying to help me learn more, which I really appreciate. So thank you guys for that, and I hope the air conditioner works out for you. But heading to the scrapyard now, and holy crap, my truck is like heated up since I don't have no back window. Like air is blown right out, right past me, going right out the back window. So I gotta hurry up, uh, get stuff dropped off, and get home. Uh, I can't even ride with the windows down because. 
it pulls all the air into the windows and right out the back which makes like a world tunnel inside my truck and stuff starts flying everywhere like dust dirt uh papers i got youtube st uh, nah, uh ebay stuff on my uh seat that starts blowing over i got stuff in the back like bags and stuff that are blowing all over it, it's like crazy and still trying to dodge cops here and there because i don't have lights on the trailer right now because the lot uh the wire is broke and i have no back window but y'all know that all right so i'll see everybody at the scrapyard and thank you all for watching and i'll catch you later bye all right so we had 11,220 pounds starting off with uh it changed right before i pulled off so they'll probably go with that but now we're drawing drop off the light iron i have on the trailer and then see if they'll pay me heavy metal for the springs but we'll get you guys back when we're unloading all right bye all right and we ended up with a final weight of 10,280 uh, i didn't want to show you guys dropping everything off it was kind of pointless and save you guys from watching the time lapse and everything uh, it wasn't that oh that special yeah almost hit my head so i even asked these guys also about the springs they said they're light iron but they do pay heavy for them but i have all the motors and stuff on top of them so i didn't want to dig through that and try to pull them out so go and drop them off another time or they might actually be the same price as what they pay for heavy is probably the same price i would get at the other scrapyard that's paying light iron for them all right so we'll say everybody when i'm done and tell you how much we made all right bye all right so we ended up making 55 bucks for the stuff that was on the truck and they pay 575 a hundred so that ain't that bad well, I guess it was worth it was better than nothing all as I can say and now we're gonna head home see my beautiful wife and hopefully I don't know if she has time for lunch or something take her out for lunch all right, we'll see everybody later, and thank you for watching our one of my adventures. And please like and subscribe. It helps me do more videos. And we'll see you next time. All right, bye.